Hey everybody, what's up? So I'm coming at you guys today with my second video about my Arjuni hair. Um, as you guys know, I got five wefts, two low luster, three medium luster. Um, from inches 16 to 22 inches. As you guys see, I got the newer wefts that are smaller and less densely packed. This is how the hair looked right out the package as soon as I finger combed it out of the Bantu knot. It's kind of um, frizzy looking and you know. So what I'm going to do now is begin the co-wash and I'm going to put a clip on it so that I can keep the hair together. This is the low luster 16 to 18 inch. And the, wave pattern, the pattern I got is curly C. I am using Herbal Essence Hello Hydration. And I'm just going to saturate the hair with it. Take off my ring. Make sure I get a good amount of conditioner on it so that it's easier to comb through. So I'm just going to start from the bottom and work my way up. Combing with a wide tooth comb. You can use a wide tooth comb, a paddle brush, but I chose to use a wide tooth comb. Now with the low luster hair, it is kind of tough to comb through. So you want to make sure that you take your time combing through. Of course, this video is sped up. So yeah, you want to take your time combing through because it's a little bit difficult, more difficult than the medium luster. And it's easier to break. So you want to be careful. So now I'm just going to rinse all the conditioner out and make sure I get all of it out, even out of the weft. And give it one final comb through before I lay it down. And I'm laying it flat because I don't want a curl pattern, I want it more wavy. So this is my second bundle or my second weft of medium luster 18 to 20 inch and I'm just going to repeat the same steps as far as wetting it and then saturating it with conditioner and I'm going to start from the bottom and work my way up just like I did with the last one and the medium luster is so easy to comb through it the comb slides right through it with the conditioner in it And with the low luster, I got a little bit of shedding or breakage. And with the medium luster, I only got one strand. And when I say a little bit of shedding with the first or breakage with the first one, probably like three or four strands. And I'm giving it a little plop so that it'll wave up at the top as well as just the bottom and not just the bottom. So this is how I have it laid out. And like I said, I have it laid like this because I want more of a wave instead of the popping curly C curls. So, yeah. So this is all four of the wefts that I'm going to use. I chose four out of five. And these, this is how it looks right after I co-washed them. And this is about 75% dry. As you can see, the waves are starting to pop. And this is 90% dry. Completely dry. And as you can see, that first weft to your left is kind of a higher luster and it's more wavier or less wavy than the others. This weft right here is less wavy than the others. I think it's a different texture, but it's going to work. So from this... And after co-washing to this. I love you guys. I'll talk to y'all later. Let me know what y'all think. Bye.